going on guys and welcome back to some more earthbound in the last part i gotta turn down my mic well uh that's not what happened in the last part but in the last part we beat the uh six of the sanctuary bosses and uh in this part we're gonna do none other than first of all get the hell out of delam because we don't need to go that we don't need to do more but uh we're gonna go to summers and uh go to see where that uh guy that was gonna they could take us across the ocean Something about a guy that can take us across the ocean. We're going to figure out what we can do here. But first of all, we're going to go to the shop. Remember those items we could not get earlier? Wow, I cannot fucking find my way around this place. Yeah, I took a break around Christmas uh, season because I wanted to spend time with my family because that's what you do during the holidays. I just said in the community post that Earth Bound Bears will return and resume after Christmas. So, uh, yeah, we're going to get money out first of all. We're gonna take out maybe thirty thousand dollars. Wait, I didn't mean to take out three. Hey, we're taking out thirty-three thousand. Take out thirty thousand dollars, and uh, we'll buy the. Uh, we're gonna buy the. Uh, we're gonna buy the lucky coin for Ness and Jeff. If we make Jeff carry it, and uh, yeah. His defense is 113-118, and, uh, yeah, we get to sell the coin. So then we're gonna sell, um... Let's sell the snake. We don't need that. Get a decent amount of money for it. So, uh, the lucky coin. The coin. We're gonna sell the coin of silence. And we're also gonna sell the mummy wrap, because we're not gonna need that. We don't need two of those. Anyway, so when it also comes to items, we're gonna buy, buy the diamond da band for Ness and Jeff. Who cannot equip these because uh, it'll lower his stats. We're gonna buy one of these for Jeff. Um, and his defense changed from 118 to 108. And uh, yeah, and one last thing is we're gonna buy a couple of super plus. We're gonna buy a, what, maybe two super plush bears. They're like the uh, teddy bears earlier, except they can. Big Jeff carry one. Yeah, we're gonna kind of arm up because there is gonna be kind of a difficult boss coming up if you're not prepared. Also, kind of why I recommend taking care of Delam first before you come here. What he says. Get bored. Go check out the story. Well, we already did that. I'm not gonna do that again. <laughs> the next day. Summer's always had sunny days. Anyway, so he says, to go to Scarborough, you need to cross the sea harbor. I'm also named Kraken, lives in the open. I'm faster, he's scared. Oh my god. You know what's the funny thing about this particular scene? He's gonna land on the boat. <laughs> if you're playing the, uh, Game Boy Advance Court Mother 2, which was only released in Japan. The screen's too small. And uh, he stands in a completely different spot. My picture's taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius. I do say some stuff. Okay, you ready for an instant memory? You ready, you ready to say fuzz? Well, what a great photograph. We're always going to get the some memories. He's not the captain. This is the captain. Thank you. You made my wife wake up. She quit talking about all that serious crap. It's a crap in a K to A game. The re-release is already a T for T. So, uh, I guess, like, I don't know, like, um, I don't know why I'm not reading the text, but, like, uh, I was gonna say, like, some games that might have been for everyone, like, 20 years ago, not even. The Mario Party 3 recent re-release also got a T rating because that game has little gambling in it. And we're, we're crossing the sea. Look like the open sea if there's islands. I guess there's islands in the open sea. So um, um uh, I fail at geography right there. Wait, wait, wait! I need to stop the boat. I've been a long time since I've been out. Yeah, I feel seasick. 
Oh, am I going to say I'll get seasick? Yeah, I'm wondering that too. Probably are such things. So I mean you guys are all right. Was that bald guy over there, your buddy, right? He came back from Bob. You guys must be adventurous. Uh I'm feeling much better now. Anyway, I don't think he says that if you without having poo in your party. Because interestingly enough, you do this for the poo section. I think he I don't know. First playthrough I did this. I didn't have poo. I don't know. I'd have to double check my X. There's Kraken. Here it comes. Anyway, this can be a pretty difficult boss if you can prepare it. So uh, maybe just spam your PSI attacks. Um, but with Nasty and PSI freeze. Um, just use freeze Omega, and uh, not gonna. We're gonna. Have, we're gonna. We are gonna be protected by Super Plush Bears. We're gonna hope his body solidifies. Yeah, he, he, he will know, um, Thunder Beta. I believe he'll also know Fire Beta. Because, uh, PSI Mario Beta. Unfortunately, Jeff can't do much. We're not really equipped well. Like I said, Jeff can be the best member of your two party or the worst party, depending on how you equip him. Yeah, if you took care of the part in Delam first, this isn't really too hard of a boss, and yeah. This is now level 49. Defense went up by 1. Vitality went up by 1. Max is up by 14. Max is up by 1. That's the other power of PSI Mario Omega. And this is your other guys are every little kid. We defeated the Kraken. I also helped in the battle. I think my silver is a maiden. You notice. So, uh, uh, I need to check the, uh, location to see the place right. And this is Araba. Another place where you can get Sunstroke. Um, so Sunstroke, like, like before, gets you slowly take damage, and, uh, PSI healing, uh, PSI healing off will get rid of it. It's also a hotel, and uh, he has a uh, another spot we can call your dad. Unfortunately, though, there aren't really any shops in this area, so if you're gonna buy some weapons. I would suggest doing it in uh, summers. Buy all those uh, defensive items that we're gonna buy in the beginning of this video, because uh, well, let's say this next part is this part's gonna be a little bit of a pain. Tender tribes live here. They go back to the deep. If they're still alive. Uh, we talked to him. I'm Red Snake. Yeah. What is it you want to buy? Thanks for someone pleasant over here. I don't know why I'm about to be Yeah, so, uh. I want to see if I can find a repeat of the two songs. All about. Let's see, um. Crystal Charm. Yes, Jeff can equip that. Who it does. It's my 128 and 29, and uh, let's see what the crystal charm does. You know what? We're not gonna, we're gonna take off the crystal charm. We're gonna see what that does for Jeff. I, I had no idea about this. Crystal charm must be equipped on your body. It protects paralysis attack. Also increases your speed. Yeah, it's nice to learn something new. Okay, so if we go out here, yeah, because that's all we can really do. We were- hold on, hold on. We get a fuckload of XP from this. 20,643 XP! Paul's now level 46, offense went up by 2, speed went up by 2, IQ went up by 1, max is up by 3, P IQ went up by 2. And Paul realized about our PSI freeze, um... You know what? Who's now level 39, offense went up by 2, defense went up by 
one, Pikachu went up by one. Pikachu went up by one. Max went up by three. Max went up by three. I want to show the new enemies here. Oh, there's the, uh... Oh, wait a minute, Youngstar. I'll give you your dollars. Have you made all the necessary preparations? Go to the pyramid. In front of the pyramid, there's a right on the high, the high graph. Told on stone place in front of the cross star. That was really too much. Give out a hint. What? Wait, these enemies. These are like these the uh, scalpians found in uh these are the dread scalpians. They're like the scalpians found in the uh, desert earlier, except they're stronger. So uh yeah, I get we can use some freeze attacks. They can also poison, much like before. In ten. I do. I want to see if I can show off all the enemies. There are unfortunately uh, no enemies with more than 128 items. In fact, I'm gonna double. I'm gonna double check my uh, 128 item list because one of the next areas is gonna have um, 128 items. I just gotta double check my list. Um, yeah, the next uh, one in twenty item is uh, in the next area, in one of the next areas. Not the total next area, but one of the next areas. Oh, well, these are new enemies. These are the beautiful UFOs. I like it. The, these are strong. These are essentially for UFOs, and uh, they can like heal like the other ones from ones from the desert. Nice for this. Now that's the present, and there was a royal iced tea. Let's see what that does. Ice well tea. Bruised by TX or Mr. White Teddo. Carefully selects only handpicked. Oh, only a scratch or King Shark Round brings the tea. Drink this. THP. Bad. New enemy. These are the uh, great crested bazookas. They're like the ones in the uh, a lot. Pretty much all these enemies are like the ones in the de the one desert from the falling. They're stronger. Do you see a lot of enemies in this game that are graphical redesigns? Only uh, stronger. They're just stronger enemies. This is now level 50. Offense went up by two. Matches went up by one. Jeff's now level 44. Offense went up by one. Defense went up by one. B went up by one. Guts went up by two. Vitality went up by one. Oh baby, IQ went up by three. Luck went up by two. Actual AP went up by thirteen. Boost down level forty. Oh baby, offense went up by four. Oh baby, defense went up by three. Went up by two. Guts went up by two. Vitality went up by two. Oh baby, luck went up by three. Sweet Max takes me up by twenty-two. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling twenty-two. Max took me up by one. Anyway, Taylor Swift right out of the way. A thief warrior one of the chats with Massey. Not the right order. I don't know if it's It's like this. Shit. Yeah, Paula got poisoned during this fight, so we have to use healing beta. Get rid of that. At the top. Warriors enter now. Search for the Hawkeye. You gotta make sure to get the Hawkeye. I want the XP, but I don't. I have to cut out the battle. Is anyone close to a level up? No one is. So let's. So fuck the XP. Oh. Um. taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera, ready, say fuzzy pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest memories. That cameraman always shows up at the worst fucking times. Anyway. Pyramid. Now this is kind of a maze. I'm gonna kind of guide your way out of here. I'm gonna kind of guide you out of here. If you got the uh, these are new enemies. Um, these are the fish Sherman. They're like the ones we fought in summers, except only stronger. All these enemies. enemies. Got the defensive items you bought in summers. These enemies aren't that bad, but some of them can be pretty bad. 
Yeah, 176 damage to Super Plush Bear. Thankfully, the Super Plush Bear has been able to live through a lot. But two of these, and uh, there's a mummy rat. We don't need them. Anyway, these are the uh, Guardian Hi Hieroglyphic. They can cause holds. They're very weak. They don't have much in terms of HP, but like one turn could take them out. That. We should be able to get some level ups out of this. Like, you get more level ups toward the end portion of this game than the beginning. Hey, new enemies. They're the these the uh yeah the, uh, archon. Actually, let's just show off a uh, PSR Mario Omega. Cost 40 PP, so I don't recommend using this off in this game. Yeah, those poisons, that's why I wanted to take them out. Super Plush Bear is no joke. They can kind of protect you for a while. If you buy, imagine if you buy multiple ones. What's the present? More mummy wraps. We don't need mummy wraps. Let's just throw, let's just throw out all the ones we have to clear. We have one mummy wrap. Two mummy wraps. Me, mummy rats. Yeah. New anyway, new enemy. These the uh, lethal hieroglyphics. They're like these. Uh, well, in the desert, but mine's only stronger. And they're like, and they can also poison. Yeah, but I guess the super plus spear wasn't gonna last forever. We have to pack up one though, so it should be good. Not any enemies, so I'm gonna avoid a battle with these. Neither is this, I just showcased this in. All now level 47, I keep one by one, max is p by two, max is up by five. p up by five. These are not new enemies. Okay, I'll take that. Also use flash alpha during the map. What does this item do? It's just throws in the dreadful box and you press me. Poison gone after one year. I really think I need to poison. Gas seems a little suspicious. If we can sneak around, no. Now level 41, offense map by one, max is here by two, but you also found PSI Thunder Omega, which Thunder Omega is. Oh no, Thunder Omega. Yeah, she does not know Thunder Omega. That is a new move that can hit three times. I'm not sure if Paula learned that who can. Anyways, we want to go down here so we can get the Hawk's Eye. Make sure you get the Hawk's Eye. Make sure you keep it. And however, I'm also going to give more advice. Anyway, my advice, and I also have to heal Jeff from the cold, but, uh, my advice. If you're gonna get the, uh, Oxi, make sure it's not in Pooh's inventory. You can get it back if you put it in Pooh's inventory, but, like, um, you'll know when, why, when we get out of this place. Out of life, you know. It looks like it might go into Paula's inventory. Where it's around, no. Anyway, so... If we're gonna get the Hong Kong in the very next room, make sure it's in it. If you want the easiest time, just get it in any or that isn't booze. And those that have played this game they know why. You don't it doesn't it's not like a deal breaker if it's in Poo's inventory and I'll explain why we get out of this area. That's now level 51. Offense went up by one, defense went up by one, three went up by one. Guess one by one, by talent one by one, IQ one by one, luck one by one, max is by 14, max is by four. Anyway, so it's not like a total deal breaker if we... 
Sure, and I will explain why as we get into the area. Anyway, mini boss. The Guardian General. Now, uh, these are just spam your PSI attacks. Nothing special. We, we might as well see how, uh, we might as well try Thunder Omega. Yeah, and this is three thunder attacks, and uh, yeah, we took a lot of damage on him. We should be able to stop, finish him off, not with these attacks. We did finish him off. Oh, is that level 48? Oh, baby. Offense went up by three. Defense went up by one. Speed went up by two. Oh, baby. Guts went up by three. IQ went up by one. Max HP went up by one. Max HP went up by five. Jeff's now level 45. Max HP went up by two. Pooh's now level 42. Offense went up by one. Defense went up by two. IQ went up by one. Max HP went up by two. Max HP went up by four. New enemy. These are new enemies, but uh, these are the uh, petrified world guards. They're like the ones we just fought, except they're very much weaker. So we're just gonna spam freeze beta. It, sol it solidifies because these aren't as strong as the other ones. They're just normal enemies. It did solidify. The attack. We're just gonna spam our attack. Get them. That idea. Oh, fuck. Well, we're gonna have to use a couple life noodles. Anyway, I will, uh, we just already got one of them. So we're gonna try a high risk, high reward. We're gonna see, we're gonna try, um, healing Omega with a uh, poo because. This, it might revive a party member, it might not. Might as well risk it. Revive, yes. It, it doesn't always work, so uh, it's an alternative though to using a cup of life noodles. But I only recommend using, uh, really recommend using, um, I really recommend using the, um, the rain pendant, so, um... Uh, give it to... We can kind of see what the difference is. I feel like myself, the crystal charm. Protection from freeze attack. Uh... I'm good for what it is. Well, because we have the night pendant. We're gonna need that. It's defense, we'll, we'll equip that. As we slowly walk up these stairs. I swear to god, like, Earthbound was a game I was very hesitant to play on this channel because these have been longer parts, but like, there is a reasoning to it. Anyway, so these have been longer parts, but there's a catch to them. Like, um, if I didn't, the reason I was initially hesitant to play Earthbound on this channel, even though I really love this game, that, um, Majora's Mask LP took 50 something parts, and like, um, I knew I had to make these like longer videos because otherwise, it was not level 43. Offense went up by two, defense went up by two, max is up by one, max is up by two. I knew I had to make these longer parts, otherwise, this was gonna take like 70 parts to cover everything. Earthbound's that big a game. There's the Hawkeye. Make sure you get this, and it's in Jeff's inventory, so it's better than Pooh's inventory. If you get some Pooh's inventory, I'll explain in just a little bit what happens if you get it in his inventory. Anyway. Now level 52, oh baby, offense went up by 3, got one by 1, Max is up by 1. 
Okay, so if you get the Hawkeye and Pooh's inventory, who's gonna temporarily leave our party after this? Fuck. Jesus, that was a fucking pain in the ass of a battle, but uh... Anyway, so if Pooh's gonna temporarily leave our party after this, so like, if you get it in his, in his inventory and you leave this area, S Cargo Express will just deliver it to you. Okay, so first I want to get into a safe spot so I can, uh... Heal my... Hold that I got during the battle. Level 46, offense member by 2, max defense by 3. You're almost out of this area. I want to sneak around, I want to... Well, I came close. Now level 49, max defense by 2, max defense by 1. Anyway, so we're almost out of this place. Now I just play. Well done, you've made it. Heal us. Finally meet Prince Fu. Don't be foretold I would meet you here, so it's time to show us the way of the star song. Far away from your friend. Do you understand? There's only one. I must stop you if you don't want to. Be for a while, you understand? It's the point last time I learned the star storm, or the most helpful us. Once I learn it, I'll meet up with you and ask trust me. Do again. Depends on Prince Pooh's effort that will determine. Now, there's one thing I'm gonna re recommend. Go to Jeff's inventory, and we're gonna get rid of this. We're gonna get rid of the, uh... We're gonna get rid of the crystal... Um... Hey, let's get rid of the... L we can't get rid of the laser gun. We have to put plus cargoes for... Um... They and they wouldn't even take that, so like, um... For the pack by a low, you don't... Wait, just don't... Just like that. Get rid of the protractor. Alright, we can. One thing you want to do. Alright, this is not the guy I'm thinking. Because we the power, anyway. So, um, the reason I cleared inventory space for Jeff is because, um... Well, you're gonna want, um... Well, we want the crusher beam also, but you also want multi-bottle rockets for Jeff. These are the best things Jeff... I'm also gonna give him the Crusher Beam. Jeff's offense is 105 and he can buy the Hyper Beam. Uh, that'll give us money for another, um, another multi-bottle rocket. The cell, um, don't need, we don't need this anymore. We're gonna get the French Fry Pan. Uh, Paul's gonna get that. And Paul is a fan chase from 109 119. Uh, yeah. This is enough as part of Earthbound, so next time I'm Earthbound, go to the tent. You guys, then. 